Brittany. Yeah. What's the worst job advice you've ever been given by someone? Oh, um, I kind of want to steal these <gasps> answers. <laughs> This is a really big one. I've heard it so many times. The worst job advice I've ever been given is people telling me that I really need to respect my value and, and always charge a rate if I'm freelancing or never compromise on salary and always go for what you're worth. And if they're not gonna pay you that, then you don't work for them. And I hate this advice and I've never actually followed it. So maybe I should have and I've been paid a lot more. So that advice of, of never underselling yourself, I personally just hate and I don't think anyone should ever take it and you should instead base your decisions on what you think is the most interesting and what you like, as long as you can cover your like living expenses. Back in university I used to get told all the time that it's not what you know, it's who you know. And I absolutely, like I took this full on, I was like okay, no more learning, only meeting people, you know, and it was it's the worst advice. And then I heard, I don't know who it was, like I feel like it was like Seth Godin. That's so nice of you to say. Say that actually you should focus on like making something that those people that you want to network with would be interested in seeing, would be interested in talking to you about. So focus actually on learning and growing and working and doing cool things and that will open up your network. And don't try to network without having done anything. Worst job advice I've ever been given in my entire life or worst job advice I've heard being given to people is that you should save, you should work in a place so that you can save up money to do something else that you want to do. And I think that's really the worst career and life advice in general. I don't really believe you should do anything to work towards something. You should just try to do the thing you actually want to do. My advice is don't do a job you don't like to save up money to do something else you want to do. Everyone in my office is now quitting. Um, <laughs> another thing I really don't think is good career advice is to wait till you find the thing that you actually like before you start doing it, which is actually kind of counterproductive or like a counterpoint to what I just said. I think that there's no way to know what you really want to do until you try loads of different stuff. I thought I wanted to be a rock star, maybe I still do. I thought I wanted to be a filmmaker, but when I actually went and worked in the film industry, I realized I really didn't enjoy it, right? So I think that you shouldn't wait around to find the thing that you want to do. You should just start trying stuff and see what you actually enjoy. So career advice of follow your passion, I think is not really great career advice because my passion when I was 12 was to dig holes. Ha ha ha.